All right, fine. Uh, the following function is one to one, so that's great. We don't have to worry about that. Find the inverse of the function and graph the function and the inverse. Let's start by graphing the function first. That just may help us. I'm going to graph this one in red. So this follows the form y equals mx plus b, where m is our slope, the b is the y-intercept. So we have a y-intercept at 0, 9. The slope is up 4 to the right 1, but I can also go down, one, uh, down 4 into the left 1. So that would give me these other points like this, which also indicates a positive slope. So that looks pretty good, and that would give us this line. All right, so there's that line. Now, since it's reflected across that x equals y, that's that blue dotted line right there. It won't show that on the homework. But this is what we should expect, okay, is we should re expect a reflection across that. So if I kind of looked at a 90-degree angle, uh, what, am I, what am I looking at here? It should be... Um, one. Yeah, it looks like like these two points kind of correspond with each other, and then this one should go through that point as well. But let's check just to make sure. All right, so just going back to the equation, we got y equals four x plus nine. But I'm going to replace the y and the x values with each other. So this is now x and y, and I'm solving for x. So I would subtract 9 from both sides. Now I've got x minus 9 equals 4y. And then I can divide by 4 on both sides, or I guess I can do it like this. So now I've got a y inverse function, and I'm going to change this to a 1 fourth x minus, I guess, 9 fourths. So I just divided both those by 4. So I have my uh, I have my slope, but the y-intercept there, negative 9 fourths, really isn't going to help us too much. So I may want to s find a value of x that would work well with that. Maybe something like uh, 1. So I have x which is 1 minus 9 over 4 should equal my new y value which is inverted so I'm just gonna try I just need a point so I can use the slope to find any other point other other points so 1 let's try x is 1 so that'd be a point 1 minus 9 is negative 8 over 4 which is negative 2 so 1 negative 2 will work so I got 1 negative 2 that's a point that we graphed and then I've got my slope, which is up 1 to the right 4. That would give me this point, up 1 to the right 4. But I could go down 1 and to the left 4 as well. Eesh, where does that, yeah, that puts me right there. And notice they both intersect on that same blue line right there. So down 1 to the left 4. And that gives me this line. And hopefully that helps us to see how it's reflected there along that blue line. That's how you would grab.